Somebody. Hello, sprinkle, sprinkle. Sprinkle, sprinkle. <laughs> well, we stuff. backstage with Backwoods right now. Dreamville 2024, North Carolina, Raleigh, man. It's Brie Renee Nav. We got Mandy from Horrible Decisions. And, well, no, hey. wait. Don't do that. Don't do no. that. Just Horrible Decisions right now. <laughs> okay, okay. I just want to be politically that. correct. You know what I'm saying? And none other than B-Dot himself. How y'all feeling? I'm feeling good, I'm man. Like Brad Brad Radar yes. Brad Let's Radar. Go. I love this set. It's like a studio apartment in New York, man. Isn't yeah. that crazy? <laughs> I love it. Like 2000 a month. Apartment. <laughs> without the fees, without yeah. the right. fees. And, no fees, no and, and no racks. Yeah, no, we ain't got the racks. <laughs> we ain't got the racks. Word. How y'all feeling today at Dreamville? This is great. This is my fourth year in a row being here. Uh -huh. um, ran into V. Damn. Is that not crazy? Four years? Already four years in a row. Next That's year you perform. Don't do that. Don't do that. Don't <laughs> right. do that. I be hoping I could be on the stage. But Todd will be pushing people out the way. Like, yo, you're not the performer. Go off. Go off. Go off. Yeah. But no, I love it here. Yeah, Dreamville, they do have, They should do a podcast segment and that in there. No, like for sure. Like a stage. Yeah, for that'll sure. be lit. What's been going on, though? What's Who going you on with you, uh, B-Dot? What's up? Everything's good, man. It's like my third or fourth Dreamville Fest. The first time I came, we interviewed J. Cole after he performed. Wow. You know what I'm saying? That was a great moment. You and Elliot. Yeah, me and right? Elliot. Yeah, yeah I saw man. It. Yeah. We did a post-game interview, so that was fun. But um, yeah, I'm enjoying it. Like Dreamville Fest is like going to your high school reunion. Everybody's kind of cool though. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. No, so it's a good these feeling. are the cool kids. I I'm not gonna yeah. lie. For yeah. sure, everyone here is so cool. Yeah, that's the cool kids. That's what we were saying. We don't feel like no fights gonna pop off. It ain't gonna be because no people shootout. would judge you. Like you were fighting at the Dreamville. Fest? <laughs> no, 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 they right. would judge you. They would judge you. Like what the they fuck? Would judge you. What are you doing? Yeah. Absolutely. There's no know. violence there. Right. Nah, there's no violence. It's all peace and love, man. Yeah. But it's a great environment. Everybody's drinking. Some people doing drugs. Yo, calm it's, it's, down. Oh, it's, it's the way he said drugs. No, it's the way he said drugs. He, 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 he said it. Oh, you know what I mean? We well, we rolling with backwoods, so you know <laughs> yes. we'll we roll up at any time. You know, absolutely. Yeah. And I will say, North Carolina is is it is it? I don't know, but everybody been smoking and drinking live. It's great. It's lit. I like yeah. North Carolina. Though. I think people yes. know though when you have a festival like this, that's what's it, to be expected. That's nope. why it's outside. No, nope, they took vape pens, right? Walking through, it, oh. coming in, they, they were taking the vapes. That's but what I love about real? North Carolina, man. Like the southern hospitality is different because I'm from New it York. Uh -huh. You know, so people ask you questions. How you they doing? Speaking. How you doing? They regular speak question. To you. Yeah. Just to speak. <laughs> yeah. yeah. They smiling at you. An old lady came up to me and my friends and showed me her parlay for the game later on today. Oh. Like, <laughs> hey, any of y'all know about basketball? Yeah. She put $50 on uh, DJ Burke. I was like, wow. Yeah. If it was a New York lady, get the fuck out of here, man. Right. But it was great. I love North Carolina. Now, speaking of parlay, you know, Nav got the sports show Broken Play, so he didn't want to get hit up. She should have been asking him. <laughs> she not right now. You don't know who this to put. It's looking ugly. It's looking ugly. I like UConn to take it all the way, though. UConn. You like yeah. UConn? Okay. Yeah. Yeah, I, I'm I'm going wherever the white girl is. A couple white Don't girls. Don't do that. Right? Oh, no, talking no, no the white, white girl. girl. Iowa. You talking about Iowa, women right. basketball. Women basketball, yeah. right. Okay, wait, wait. Is it's Angel UConn, Reese? That's, that's Maya Moore. Everybody's right? white on those scenes. Maya so. Moore is my, UConn. Well, <laughs> no, uh, 20 years ago. Yeah, she was. She at was, one point. At one point, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. You went throwback. Wait, is Angel Reese out of it? Yeah. No, she's out. They she, out. Oh, okay. I was about to say, how you going to go? She's at Dreamville Fest. Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> they lost to the white girl. He talked to Oh, okay. They lost to the white girl. She's okay. here, though. Yeah. Shout out to her. Anybody y'all looking forward to seeing perform tonight or this weekend? Ooh, J. Cole. Mm. Duh. For sure, J. Cole. Um, I'm super excited. We came here on time for Sexy Red. Mm. And what's crazy is hey, she didn't that bitch got hits. Yeah, she, she didn't know. So no, and she did it. Yeah. Can I tell y'all? She had the nigga Gucci slides on stage, yeah. and then them oh. was uncomfortable. She kicked them off. She kicked them off. She kicked I didn't even off. see it with no shoes Baby. on. Baby. I was like, damn, did she ever wear shoes on stage? You know, you know what's crazy about Sexy Red is that for all the rap girlies that are doing their thing, and I love the rap girlies, she just seems so authentic. She came on Horrible Decisions, and she was so authentically her. Yeah. I love me some Sexy the Red. The same. She seems like she's the same. Baby. She is me when I was... 17, 18. Wow. Yeah. I, she ain't me no more, but she me. I think I, I, I live through her. And I think that's why all the women love Sexy Red because we all done had a Sexy Red phase. Mm -hmm. We did. You know I mean? we, we actually did. We all done had, like, you might be evolved now. <laughs> you might be in your church girl era or your soft girl era. Y'all relapse too. Yeah. 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 It, it reminds it bring, yeah. it, it bring it out. It bring yeah. it out. It be like, okay, this remind me when I was hanging out with the mm -hmm. LCAT SRT. <laughs> you feel me? That explains it because when, you, like you said, she came on the Gucci flip flops, but like she was about to do some errands afterwards. <laughs> yo, chill. yo, you gotta chill. I, but no heels, yeah. no and heels. I just love it. And it, it still was sexy. And she's she's authentically her. And then literally hit after hit 
after yeah. hit, yeah. she not missing. Yeah. Yeah. And the crowd rocking with And they too. know her shit. Yeah, yeah. They, that's what I'm saying. The crowd was really I w- singing I was along. saying, I, I'm excited, only because I'm a 90s baby, for Monica's set and Jeezy's set tomorrow. Mm-hmm. Absolutely. So them two I'm ready yeah. for. For sure, I'm for I love me a good Atlanta me. moment. Anytime. You know who I want to see too? SZA. I'm SZA, excited yes. to see SZA. I, I want to see SZA. Tour. She's good. Yeah, I saw her But she was here too. year one of Dreamville, I believe. Oh, she was? Wow. Yeah, she was actually on the other stage, but she was here either year one or year two. Yeah. Just got to see her at the SOS yeah, uh, that was a tour. crazy tour. That tour Yo, was that amazing. bitch was like floating in a boat. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> no, no, she Not was. In the, yeah. in the air. In the air. In the air. Where is how she said? How she was just floating, floating in a boat. boat. No, no she, but it's good knows. to see that because you don't see a lot of artists take um, pride into their set mm-hmm. and their, their their stage presence and all that. Mm-hmm. So to her, see her, like you said, floating in a boat across the, in the <laughs> air, it was like, okay, you really care about your... Nah, she did. She did. So then, do y'all think it's fair to say that we'll never see Future at a Dreamville Fest? I think it, they can't say nah, never. Nah, never say too never. Too soon. Never say never. Yeah. You think it's too soon? Yeah. yeah. But he allowed that that shit to happen. I don't think song. that was towards Future, though. I think J. Cole and Future still probably straight. You think so? I think, I think it was a it was a shot at the big three, though. No, no? shot at the Hold big on. three. I think so, we'll see it happen. Yeah? Yeah. yeah. I mean, Drake listen, Drake, J. Cole has a lot of juice. So he, I think if does. he puts a call in, I think Future will come through. Absolutely. You know what I'm and besides, for the people. Yeah, the people yeah, want not, to see future. The future th- th- we do. You know what I'm saying? Like, and he just dropped what two albums in like a month? Yeah, with, like man. the next yeah. album's on the way. I, it's on, on the, the way. Week. No, yeah. like yeah. another one is coming, yeah. right? We still don't. We, trust don't, we still don't. We still, still don't. Trust. And still, still don't. Yeah, I like the still is capitalized. Yeah, yeah. I, don't I feel trust like y'all no. motherfuckers. <laughs> and don't. How could somebody earn your trust back in two, three weeks anyway? Though, like we still don't trust you. So real quick, once you once you don't trust somebody. How do they gain your trust back? How long or, does it take? How long does it, it take? It takes time. That's what I'm saying. Two, three weeks ain't long enough. How much time? Enough. I feel like you got to show consistent improvement for a good 90 days to six months. Damn, 90, 90 days? days 90 days to six months. I'm a forgiving <laughs> person, though. That's like a clinical I trial. I don't, I don't hold no grudges. Okay. I, as long as you don't make the same mistake over and over and over again, like, I, I'm going to give you one mistake free. In 90 days, do you even give a damn if they still trust you? <laughs> right. At that wow. point, I'm yeah, over you it. you got it. You got it. But I'll tell you who I'm looking forward to is seeing 50 Cent, man. Yeah. Okay. he just came when, off that we, crazy when he, tour. When she just was talking about hits, I think we forget he has hits. Yes. Hits, for And sure. also those mixtape cuts, so I'm hoping he performs those tonight. You know, he just had that crazy tour. Uh, last year was, he did a whole yeah. like international yeah tour. he did the whole yeah. planet you know I will say that did upset me and I'm just gonna be honest why is that because Chris Brown is one of the best performers uh, that I've ever seen live and so to 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 switch up Chris Brown with 50 and then Money Long with Huncho mind you Huncho fine Oh, Huncho! I here? just want to Huncho. Yeah, he's, Huncho. yeah, he's gonna be Huncho's tomorrow. Here too. Tomorrow. Right? I don't know what he sounds like, but he's fine. <laughs> he is. He, he I is. Double tap. Every yeah. time I see nah, he, he got some good. He, he got some good. That man is gorgeous. <laughs> he got some. Good. He got like, some hits too. But it's like you remove two R and B artists and you mix it with hip hop. But we'll see. I'm not gonna lie, many men. I feel like many men wish that upon me. I want many men. I, I want to see, see. I want to excited. I want to hear 21 questions. Of course, okay. that's gonna happen. I, wanna, I, I just want to hear the quarters. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you you want 21 questions over? What is y'all's favorite 50 record? I like minus 21 questions for sure. I, it's probably a mixtape cut, so I would have to. Of course, it just, not. It just, it just depends on the day. Yeah. You know which one? But I would go um, maybe call uh, 50 balls of pleasure. It's from uh-huh. his early mixtape days. So it's okay. like one of my favorites. And okay. he is going to oh, drop definitely those not performing it. He's not performing it. He's definitely it. <laughs> not performing it. But it's one of my favorites. What's your favorite 50 record? I don't know, man. He, if he dropped this a big rich town, I don't, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> That's my Yo. shit too, no? That but no, yeah. I'm the man. I'm the man. That's now, a good uh, one too. I'm the man. Oh, with Rotimi. Yeah. No, wait. No, with Chris Brown. That was with Chris Brown. Yeah. Bitch, I'm the man. Bitch, I'm the man. 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 Yeah, that's a good joint. Nah, I want many men. I want many men. I'm going to become like, I'm going to feel like, motherfuckers out here trying to kill me. I want many men. I'm going to I'm going to become like, I'm going to feel like, motherfuckers out here trying to kill me. I love many men. Yeah, for sure. you, many men came out when I was in middle school. Right, right. I already know. That's how I feel about Jeezy, though. Jeezy made me feel like I'm in a trap. Cooking up dope. My baby mama busting, knocking at the door. The feds about to kick in. Like, I just feel like I really got street cred when I listen to Jeezy. And I know Jeezy's having that show in Atlanta on the 11th. The, yeah. Like, the B-side fan favorite yeah. show. So, yeah. uh-huh. I don't know. I'm going to have to Are take a gray- I might have to take the Greyhound out there. Not the Greyhound. Man, it's going to take you three weeks to get there. You better start now. You, you better start 
I, I, I gotta go. <laughs> so yeah, I'm a big Jeezy fan. I'm definitely looking forward to it. Same, I just yeah. got to see him. He has a residency at Dre's in Vegas. Oh wow. And oh, I'm I just, didn't know that. Yeah, literally just Man, saw him. Be moving around. And yeah. you. <laughs> so I was nominated at the AVN Awards, but he had his residency that night. And I was like, I'm slanging. I don't know what dope. I don't even know what really dope is. I'm dope, but I don't know what dope is. But I was slanging it that night. Yeah, yeah. When, when, when Jeezy get on stage, it's, it's amazing. See, you feel like you be slanging it. Jeezy make me feel like I'm cooking it. I don't know the measurements to that shit, but I feel <laughs> like I'm in there rocking up some. You, huh? you are a. You, where are you from? I'm we from both Atlanta. from Atlanta. From Atlanta. But you, you up north. Yeah, from New York. Queens, born and raised. So how do you, how do you resonate with like a Jeezy, like? The down south artist. It took some time getting used to at first. Because when Jeezy okay. first emerged, it was like post 50 Cent era. That G unit era, I was still in that bag. You had the tank top on? So when he came. <laughs> oh, yeah, them white beaters. The, the white beaters? Yeah, yeah what tank top The most white beaters. Yeah. The big band on yeah, the big band. band string. <laughs> the G unit boots. <laughs> I was G unit out. Right. So it took some getting used to, but eventually he was like, yo, I had the t shirt. I was Jeezy. I was Team was, Snow. Yeah. Absolutely. I'm a big Jeezy fan, man. It's sure. crazy because in Florida, they uh banned them snowman shirts. No, they literally said it was like gang affiliated. Really? They bent. What? You can wear them to school. You can wear, yeah. you wear, yeah. wear them to school. You could not wear snowman shirts to school. What if you just like it's Christmas? That's why he came out with can't ban the snowman. <laughs> he does I, I did not like know Christmas. that y'all experienced that too. <laughs> yeah, oh, yeah, we did. Maybe yeah. that was a They banned it right out in our city first. first. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> that's crazy. And that reached down to Florida because yeah. we couldn't wear snowman shirts to school. Yeah. Wow. That's why he came out with can't ban the snowman. Yeah. Oh, like, wow. Yeah. 20 years later. Here we are. Hey, baby, I need a snowman shirt for tomorrow then. Yeah. Hey, yeah, backwoods, make it happen. <laughs> make backwoods and a snowman. A right backwoods and snowman shirt. No, for sure. Make the private cipher complete. <laughs> backwoods and snowman t-shirt. Love it. Yeah. No, but what y'all got going on? I know you got a new podcast coming up. You working on a couple things. I am. I am. Give us some um, exclusives. So, not exclusives. Y'all already know. Uh, ended one shit. Ain't coming back. Um, <laughs> Don't do that. Don't do that. Be that. I'm not doing anything. Um, but I'll be at Black Effect Festival in Atlanta. For sure, uh, for sure. At the end yeah. of the month. Yeah. Will y'all be there as well or no? Yeah, I'm so Okay. Good. Good and then uh, Together Land Fest Dallas, we're headlining the podcast stage. How y'all, and, well, let me ask you this though. How y'all end some shit and then still, like, we still gonna show up? Like, are no, y'all no, no. I, ended, I ended the other pod. Me and Horrible, we, we're almost at eight years now. Wow. Oh, okay. We've almost been we've been it up for that. Yeah. 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 It, we've almost, we're almost at eight years yeah. now. So, um, See, the thing is, was a great run for three. That's it. Um, but yeah, we're, we're doing Together Land Fest. Um, we're, we got a show in London coming up. It's oh, wow. oh, like I'm up. excited. We're writing a book with Charlemagne. Really excited about that. And then I have Period Sis dropping. I also have an animated series coming out. Oh, I'm, yeah, I saw that. Yeah, That's super dope. Like, I'm, I'm making a cartoon. I ain't going to hold you. Y'all hear my voice? Mm. Yeah. In five years, I don't want to talk. I just want y'all to know who I am. And I can just walk around <laughs> and be like... Yeah. Like a white woman. Uh, <laughs> I'm trying to sell everything to the to the white man and make a whole bunch of millions. Right. So yeah, where you gonna ride? On? Hold on, I'm, look, I'm, what's going on with Rap Radar? <laughs> right. What, what's the? Because uh, podcast land. I don't know if everybody knows. I, I want to ask you. IRL don't exist anymore. Yeah. And so when is y'all's next interview? What you doing with? Yeah, uh, Rap Radar podcast. We're coming back. We're looking for a new home. We got some. Uh, things on the table you know i don't want to count my chicks before they hatch but i'm really got, upset sure. y'all dropped a clip of that two chains interview but i can't find the full oh, yeah. interview yeah. why did y'all do that so i logistically it was just a parenting company thing you know what i mean because okay. the company dissolved so we have a new situation we're re-uploading all the new interv old uh, interviews so they're going to be available um within the next couple of weeks so but specifically the two chains no one, and i was waiting because be... i'm like this is new he's at candyland yeah so yeah we went to yeah. candyland two, two chains and and shout out to sunny digital they're like owners in the new strip club yeah. in atlanta mm -hmm. for sure and so when i saw that y'all interviewed him at candyland i said yeah, this is recent a... yeah yeah saw the clip couldn't find it anywhere right. i said b dot elliot what where the fuck is this yeah interview at? it was where a politic fuck? thing so we're okay. going to re-upload it it's going to be available within the next maybe a couple days and um yeah we're going to get it popping again i love it i'm gonna look out for that man had beef like she wanted to ask you that from the get like, like, she she yeah. to ask and it. It. Where, the <laughs> where the by, fuck is the full by, interview by, by the way i i just want to shout out to two chains because one of my favorite 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 fucking shows is most expensive yeah most expensive that was on vice and yeah. then got bought out by gq i want it back yeah i need him being ignorant 
with all the expensive shit. Okay. <laughs> I love to don't we all want to do some expensive shit? Some ignorant, we do. Expensive some ignorant. Yes. Expensive. I be yeah. wanting to do ignorant. No, it was like you love to see it too. <laughs> yeah, yeah, <laughs> absolutely. No, but um. What I was about to say? Nothing. I was about to ask you something. Girl, I'm about to ju- go try to holler. There's some fine little motherfuckers here. Shout out to Dreamville. <laughs> How many drinks you had, man? We have. We live right now. We live right now. I ain't calling up backwards. You drinking. We feeling good. We feeling great. You know. Look, there we go. What well, number, y'all, what this has is? been another episode of The Bell. <laughs> we chilling. We chilling. <laughs> What'd Look, you I told you all she wanted to ask was be that. That's all she wanted to ask. You chilling? I'm gonna go. I said we'll be that. I'm gonna holler at y'all later. <laughs> I'm glad it's coming soon. Though. I love what y'all are yeah, doing. We yeah, we will be back real soon. Both with of the y'all been doing the real. No, but both of y'all have been in the pod like personality and podcast space for a minute now. You know, so many people. It done took over now. It's like the new thing yeah what's some advice y'all would give to people who like trying to navigate just starting out maybe they on first season of they show they just not getting in this space i would say just be consistent with it that's it because a lot of times people they start they start they start you know just be consistent with it whether you get you know two views today you get 20 the next week yeah just be consistent things will come yeah be patient be patient be patient and get your paperwork right that too (laughs) oh shit up front get it even if they're your friend, get it oh, up. Boy. Get, figure it out. Don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do that. Be that. Um, get your paper. Do you friends. feel like you should do business with friends? Never. Mm, I would never suggest it again in life. Dang. Um, it's ne- hard. Definitely not 50 50. But if you know someone is strong in something, hire them as an independent contractor and pay them for their services. But the partnership thing gets a little tricky. Um, and I just think. We, none of us really know each other's like work style when yeah. it comes to this. And we are all still, if you're asking about podcasters, we're all still creating the blueprint to it. Yeah. This yeah. is still like Creatives this is still, still like new. ten to fifteen new. years new ish. Yeah. 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 And so But that's big we, though. We we've seen the bubble kind of happen right now where we were all making a lot of money. Right now the podcast bubble has kind of bursted a little bit. But it's like, okay. It's really building a fan base, and mm-hmm. you know, having people like what you have to, what you have to offer. Yeah. Like B Dot's questions is not going to be my questions. Yeah. Absolutely, but B-Dot's not. yeah. Everybody, yeah. you know, he's going to be like, tell me about the process. I'm going to be like, which city has the best hoes? And <laughs> I might both the perspectives. You know what I mean? Right, right. He just did an interview at Candyland. Yeah. Candy yeah. Land. With who? And he just did an interview at Candyland. So yeah. I think he's going to see. There you go. Yeah. yeah. But, I, but, that was like, but also. They Being authentic that. to you who you I mean? are. And I, I think that's what you're saying. Be authentic to who you are as a personality and then you'll get that fan base. And they'll not, rock with you no matter where you right. at. But not only that, having a tough skin, that would be my my advice. Mm-hmm. B dot drops these lists every motherfucking year that are trash. And they hate and so, Yeah, I don't be rocking with your <laughs> list either. You know, I don't be oh, rocking. Nah, shit. I feel like I yeah, be one I be like, how the like, fuck you leave <laughs> such a set off of that? I think he do it too. Oh, yeah, he do, he do. I do. You got this yes, too. Yes, keep it real list. Tell the truth. Tell the truth. I'm telling the truth. What's up, Gail? Gail Bean over there. That's my hey. sis. We got to get Hello. a step in the trap. Hello. So. In the, the trap. Beautiful. Matter of fact, Gail could probably yeah. sit in for me since y'all Look, about to interrogate no, me. No, so, uh, no, no, yeah, no. We ain't done talking to you. Yeah, we're going to get you when you come back. Gail so fine. Gail yeah. so lit. Yeah. And. Don't look. Okay. <laughs> you know it's serious when we start repping our zodiac time. Huh? It's like Aries in the motherfucking building. Libra. Uh no. huh. <laughs> ATL in the building. Oh, yeah, yeah. That look on him. Yeah. That look, that look on you. We don't say that. <laughs> hey. <laughs> that shit is not. Yeah, that shit. Thank nah, but yeah, be not, I feel like you be trying to, he you do. be triggering people with nah. the list. Yeah, see? I do an inventory every year. Not an inventory. I take, a, I take, a, take notes since January 1st and then December 31st. I, you know, I try to figure out who's doing what. I want to see your notes throughout the year. You want to see yeah. your notes throughout the year? We right. gotta, if it's I, giving cap. What's on the list so far? Right now, I'll tell you. If, someone, if you would have asked me who's like the best rapper so what's far What's on the list so far? I got J.I.D. He's doing his thing. Okay. okay. I think J.I.D. Be here right now weekend. is the best rapper on the planet today. Okay. Okay. And he's an Atlanta guy. He is. You know he what I'm is. saying? He is. Um, of course, Schoolboy Q. He's School put Boy his numbers Q. up. I like Benny the Butcher. He had a great album this year. Um, uh, Who else? J. Cole just dropped his new EP. Okay. You know what I'm saying? So How you feel about that? The new EP I like it. Just I like okay. it. I'm still digesting it, but I like what I hear. You know, so everyone's doing their thing. You know what I mean? I like it. Crocodile Tears is one of my favorite. Crocodile I like Tears it. 3001 and is my Pi. favorite. 
pie. And I, like I love that, that he done brought in all them TDE niggas. <laughs> yeah, oh, man. Petty. You love it. I love a little like, petty. Like, little petty rap being a little petty on the slot. Of course, like, yeah. man. It's a light skin I thing. I like it. <laughs> I think it's premeditated. He was petty. I like it. I think it's premeditated. And I think it might lead up to a he concert or a tour. First, first, first off, getting this album makes me know we are we were all anticipating the fall off mm -hmm. yeah. which we know is going to be his last project probably so to me this being named something else and not the fall off mind you that uh Trey in Ibiza yeah mm -hmm. he mentions the fall off yeah. so i feel like that would have that that was supposed the to be prerequisite, something yeah. that was something that was coming. supposed to be probably though in the fall off and he was like nah, let me drop this album now Cole, Cole is it yeah. he him Period. I don't think he ever gonna like just retire. Nah, from it. rappers yeah, never no. really retire. It's never, yeah. yeah. And he's aging well, so he could keep going. You know yeah. what I mean? My mama was just like, "You're gonna be sixty years old at the Dreamville Fest and will." <laughs> <laughs> Lit. Word. All right. Well, let everybody know where they can follow y'all and keep up with everything y'all got. You can follow on. me at b dot tm on Instagram and Twitter, mm -hmm. or you just see me with Manny whenever we in the Yo, streets. Yo, calm down. You don't be with me for real, for real. <laughs> um, y'all can follow me everywhere at Full Court Pumps. Y'all can listen to me every Monday um, on Horrible Decisions. Type of horror we pop up. That's right. Spell it like you hear it. Nice. And then every Wednesday, period. <laughs> since. Um, and I'm outside. Period. We about to go get another drink for Mandy so we can turn no, up. No, girl, this is it. This, this is, is it. it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, we rolling with Backwoods Backstage Dreamville 2024. We out. Yeah. yeah.